Hi, Derek with Continental Door here, and I'm going to go over today um, your Lanier wall button. And these are your wall buttons are the same on all your Lanier motors across the board. This in particular is a DC motor, but that does not matter. So there's a couple functions that your wall button will perform. Obviously, to open and close your door, right down here with the green LED. Pretty simple. Go down. If you want to stop it on anywhere in between, you just go ahead and push it. Then you also have a light button, and this works just like any other light button or light switch. You just would push it off, push it on, and that will remain on until the motor is either ran via the push button or your remote, and then it will return back to its, its trip sweat, uh, switch. But it is just like a light switch, so right now this motor should be on forever until you either turn it off or you run it by here again and then it'll turn off in like two minutes. Now the other thing that's very nice that this motor has is it's a lock switch. So I'm gonna show you right now this remote that works the door, it's going up. It's gonna go back down. Now by flipping this red switch here, it shuts off um, any transmission to that motor that was ever programmed. Not even your own remote will work it. So right now I just pushed it and it's gonna click and say, no, I will not open. And that's just added security. If you go on vacation or, you know, you just want that peace of mind, instead of climbing up a ladder and potentially being in an unsafe uh, predicament and unplugging it, this does just as good as that. Now the wall button will still work it. If someone was to get into your garage, they have access to everything. So that still works it, but your wireless keypad, uh, your truck, anything that was ever programmed to this will no longer work uh, wirelessly. So reds are dead, turn it back on, and you're back in business. Just push your remote and it's good to go. Now one thing to know also about your vacation mode that I found on Lanier is when this is engaged and the door is open, it will shut because you have to go to go on vacation. So once you push your remote, it will close, but once this garage door gets to the, the down position, you will no longer be able to get back in the garage with your own remote. So um, if you do that, you get in your car, you, you push your remote still, that is proper because now it's down and it does not work. Thanks for watching and let us give us a call or look us up online if you need any help. Thank you.